What is going on guys? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. We are continuing where we left off in the last one. So what we're actually going to go do today is we're actually going to go ahead up our last set of races, uh, which happen to be all the way up here. Um, looks like uh, we're going to start off with a point to point to get things rolling this week. Um, well, uh, well, we're not at the beginning of the week, but you know what I mean. <laughs> Next episode is going to be um, Horizon Adventures. And so is the uh, the last episode of the week. Uh, I think uh, Wednesday is the last day that uh, these um, these races are actually available. Uh, I'm not sure if this video actually goes up while it's still active or on transition. Can't really remember. Um, I think it, I'm, I'm sure it's Wednesday when it refreshes onto like the next season um, or the next seasonal events uh, pop. Can't really remember. Um, but yeah, um, I've, well, next week's going to be a bit of a weird week, um, as uh, we're going to do the races and then we're all going to continue with the Horizon Adventures. We're going to fully finish those off um, next week, as well as, uh, I'm not sure if there's going to be another mission at the end of the Horizon Adventures to like, sort of wrap it up, wrap the up the festival a little, uh, a little bit more. Not hundred percent sure yet. Um, if not, what we'll do is we'll uh, we'll go out and do the uh, the other races which we've sort of started but not hundred percent finished. Uh, it's the ones which we started a, quite a while ago now. Um, you know, to get a shortcut. Um, but yeah, we'll finish those other ones off as well. Um, we'll also do any of the missions which we've uh, we've sort of done them, but. Um, like we've completed the series, but like there's been like a couple of missions we just haven't done because we skipped over them. Um, we'll complete those as well. Um, so everything's going to get like 100%ed, um, more or less, uh, next week. Um, which is uh, exciting, but um, next week's going to be different because uh, it might be the last week we actually play this game. <laughs> which means that I, during the week uh, I need to uh, make sure I've downloaded all updates and DLC. For the next set of games we're going to be playing, we're going to be go back and do some DLC, I think, um, on some games we played uh, throughout last year, uh, such as Watch Dogs and um, uh, Assassin's Creed. Uh, there's another one. In 400 meters, <laughs> Hold on, were they, were they not last year? Were they the year before? They could have been. Turn sharp left. We've had a busy, um, a busy end of last year. I don't remember what we played now and what year we played it. And I think it was last year. I don't know. I see a bonus board. While we're here, and I see it, we're going to grab it. But yeah, we'll, we'll do those. I'm actually excited. Uh, next week will be the last and final week. Um, it'll be good, though. It'll be good. Be a nice change of pace for a little while as well, especially, especially when we've um, when we've done as many videos for this game as we have. It'd be nice to get back to Assassin's Creed for a little In while. Meters, turn sharp I missed that game. I had a lot of fun recording it. I'm not gonna lie. I had some tech problems with it, but ah, I think that was actually like. 2021, I think we did that. Oh, the no more in 2022. So it was 2020, I think, when that game came out originally. So it was like the beginning of last year when we finished it off. Round about this time. Also. And then we did um, Wolfenstein, didn't we? That was a good game, too. I enjoyed that. I actually really enjoyed that game. Uh, the whole game series itself. Need to uh, need to find another game series to play through. Uh, I, I quickly went through the game series at which I wish to play. Just uh, now we need to go through and uh, play game the game series that I, I want to play. I don't have a, actually have a list um, yet. I need to go make a DLC list for um, for games we played recently. You have arrived at your anyway, destination. We have arrived. Uh, is this the right one? 
I think that's it right there. Alright, let's uh, yep, current ship. There we go. That's the one we're looking for. Just double checking to make sure it is the right one. Okay, we've got a wrist there, we've got one over there. Okay, they were all reasonably uh, close together, to be fair. Alrighty, let's see what cars we can use. Let's go have a look at the recommended of buying cars. Um, okay, so we're in the C class still. Um, we have a Toyota. Um, we have a Mercedes Benz. We have that truck again, the Lamborghini truck. Uh, we have a Jag. I'm thinking something along the lines. Do we have that Mercedes Benz? Do we have that in our car collection already? I know. No, we don't. I was thinking about the Mercedes Benz or that Toyota. But you know what? Mm, I don't know if I want to go Toyota or Mercedes Benz. Uh, no, we'll go, we'll go Mercedes. We'll buy a car. Why not? Right, let's have a look at the uh, the colours. Oh, the stock colours is just black. Alright, we'll go with that. A lot of dark colours this week, but there we go. There's another 150,000 uh, down the drain. <laughs> we can afford it, though. I like buying cars. It increases our collection, too. That's my main goal. Get as many cars as we can. Let's see what this car's like, though. The car I learned to drive in was a Mercedes. It's a nice Mercedes. Many years ago, that was. Right, let's do this thing. Bit of wheel spin there. Looks like we're going right up the hill, so... Three wheel drive as well. Yeah, I missed that. Holy moly. I didn't know I missed that. Didn't feel like I missed it. Oh, I must have only just missed it though. That time I didn't. And that guy's uh, car definitely slowed me down. So this is an all an uphill race. We're going to be fighting all the way up to the top, I guess. There you go. I kept the slide going. <laughs> yeah, we're in fifth place, but not doing too bad. Point to point. I like me point to points. The thing is, though these point to points. The road surface is very, very slippy we're using a real wheel drive car. And the road surface is like proper slick. It's hard to keep a car under control. I'm using him as a bit of a cushion. I just keeps on losing grip. All the power's in the back end. It just makes the uh, the rear go. There's not a lot of weight there on the on the back. Come on, go car, go. like to get up to speed very quick either. Especially when it changes gear. It takes quite a while to change gear. Oh. Tempting to sort of uh, keep the speed up but Without losing too much traction, I think it's the traction what's really slowing us down right now. It's going to start getting uh, quite turny up here. Doing a 
little bit of concentrating as I uh can't miss that, yeah I did. I thought I did. I think I took the carnage a little bit too tight. That wasn't too bad going through that. Missed that. I think I turned a little bit too early. Holding out a place though, it's sixth. We're halfway, well, we're halfway up the pack. Be nice if I could get fifth. I just don't think we can quite get it. Not with this car and how slick it is. That walls there. We went right off the cliff. Got corners here and everything just to try and claw something. But, but I think we're keeping about the same distance away from this guy. Not a bit further back. I'll take that place. Not the best car in the world to be uh, <laughs> to be going uphill racing in, and the, plus the road surfaces, especially um, especially on these sets of races this week, they're just incredibly slick. It's like driving on grease. I, I like driving on ice, even. Don't know if uh, any of you guys have driven on ice before, but the just like it, like the like the feel of like you, the car actually just moving without you putting any inputs in the car. It's what it feels like. Okay, that's a point to point, and that's a lap. Uh, we'll go there because it's going it's going to be in city. Gets us about halfway there. What we'll do though is we'll take the the quick way down. Because I am lazy. <laughs> We just driven all the way up just to drive uh, Turn to go around, back down. But it's just safe to do so. This car just really doesn't like. Well. Right, where can we go over here? Over to the right. Uh, I think the car's a little stuck, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, what do we do if the car's stuck? I'm not 100% sure, I've never actually got my car stuck before. Is there like a I'm stuck setting? Not 100% sure what we're supposed to do if we get stuck like this. Not sure if the car will eventually get grip or not and just pull the car back. It's 100% rear wheel drive and starting to get some sort of grip there. I'm just putting it on this lock just to see if we can uh, attempt to move it off the rock a bit. I actually never got a car stuck like this before. Is there a setting or something I can I can press to say that we got stuck? Um Nope. Um just see if there's anything in there. Hundred percent there's a There we go, I think that I think that there was the car stuck position there. There we go. That's what it is. I thought there would be a car got stuck position. What 
we could, uh, could use. There we go. First time I've, I've actually had to use that in this game. Never had to use that before, until now. Knew it was probably a set. Getting down the mountain reasonably quick. Well, quite quick as well, like 60 miles an hour down a hill like this. I'm missing every tree. I think that's the first time I've ever gone down or up that hill without hitting one tree. As he says, as he hit like six skims a tree. That was actually reasonably good for me. Not gonna lie. Anyway, let's get on to our next, uh, our next race. Like, this thing likes to slide. It really does. It likes to slide and it doesn't have the grip. I used to really be, um, I used to be a guy who really liked rear wheel drive cars because of how slippy they can get with the rear end, but when you're trying to, when you're actually trying to race and you want grip, really you want like front wheel drive or four wheel drive, you really do. Like I, I believe my car in real life is actually four wheel drive, so. It's nice in the snow, it's actually, uh, I, I've driven it in the snow already and I actually really enjoy doing it. That was the last year though, that was. Oh. You can literally hear how this thing just... I think it's one of those cars where it's got like a little bit too much power for its own good. Like, I think the car just needs to be a little bit heavier. Not a lot, just just a bit. In 100 meters, turn right. It would uh, run 100% nice if it would just add a little bit more weight. I think, I think it just needs a little bit more rear over the rear, uh, over the rear tires. Just to give it, like, it needs a bit more downforce, I think. But anyway, we'll continue in this car. We'll see what we can do. Might not win this uh, race series, but might have a couple of close races and might be fun. Racing in the city is probably not going to be fun. <laughs> I think the only time we've raced in the city was, uh, and I've actually enjoyed it, was last week. We'll see what this one gives, so here we go. Oh, we just slick around that corner. First place though and second place have just absolutely zoomed off and left everybody. If I can get like third place, I'll be happy. I'm sitting here with uh, quite a few of the pack here. It's good. A bit of a trade and paint there. Got a nice. crash barrier there but I think what we need to do as well when we actually start wheel spinning on like that is just release the power for a second or reduce the power yeah so just like reduce power for like a like a split second yeah it helps unless if you like like right now where you want it to slide there we go that gets grip Up there when I actually wanted it. I'll to be honest with you, I'll take a third place though. We can hold it. I don't 
didn't like that. Didn't like that one bit. Just tapped the wall and it's sent us flying. Oh wow, that was actually uh, quite a nice little drift around there. I like that. There's one thing you can say about the like the slickness of these tracks right now is I really like how how it uh, in some corners we can really get a slide. We're holding on, on the third reasonably well. I'm liking this. I'm liking the track to be honest. It's not too bad. It's going to be a high speed corner. Think we can just do it? Yeah. That one. Not so much. Okay, so this is just uh, one. Like a sort of like a chicane. Coming up. Take third place. I'll take third place by quite a bit actually. But that was a good race, I enjoyed that. That was a good one. Not bad. That was a well rounded third place. I don't think I bullied my way up that much, to be fair. Alrighty. Not sure where that's going to put us. It's going to put us a reasonably third. If we can uh, come high up in the next race again, um, we might have a bit of a chance actually. Third place, yeah, yeah. If, I think we come back from worse <laughs> before in the uh, in the past. Right, let's give this thing a go. I love how like um, in the middle of the races it's um, all rainy and slick and wet, and then you come into like this where it's sunny you couldn't get drier if you tried <laughs> turn right at the roundabout take the third exit to be honest with you right now in the UK it's um it's really cold it's not very icy though it's cold not cold enough to be meters. ice turn but we're getting uh, like like sort of like sleet to snow turn sharp stuff like that at the minute um, especially in the northern parts of the UK where I live. That's what it's like, but it, it hasn't actually been too bad. Like, it hasn't even been ice on the car recently, um, which is a bit weird. Um, it doesn't take that uh, my car that long to uh, de-ice itself anyway. It only takes about like 5-10 minutes. And it's uh, completely meters, ice free. Turn left. Turn left. I'm just going to go around that because I don't want to trigger it. But uh, yeah, we're not too far away from the last race here of the uh, of this little season. And we'll see what's going on. Let's see if we can win this. You have arrived at here your destination. Go. I'm actually really looking forward to this last race. I, I want to see how well we can do. <laughs> probably only going to be like a three lap race. We're probably going to come in about hopefully third ish. We'll see. We'll give her a go. Here we go. Slickers race track uh, and pause her. Let's do it. Round roundabout. Starting off in it. And, you know, just get rammed. Straight off the get go. We can actually keep it quite fast through this. Not much of a track to really learn. It's really just a major loop around this. Uh, 
this bit of rock right here. So we need to start clawing our way up. We've only got three laps to do as well. We're already halfway through this one and we've uh, only gained one place. Not good. And we've lost. Lost the place. Alright, let's see what we can do. Here we go. Second lap. It's not looking good. Yeah, we're gliding all over the place right now. I'm not sure you losing that uh, rear wing is going to do much. If it does or not. I think we've all settled into where we are though. There we go, we're getting the place again. See how old tracks there from the last lap. I think we just lost the place exactly where we just lost it last time. The thing is that this car is so slippery. It's crazy. Right under the last lap here, yeah, we're not gonna claw up at all. I was hoping to our way up a little bit more than we already have, but uh, it's just not going our way. We've got one last uh, send it lap. I'm just gonna I'm gonna hit everything here, but it's a send it lap. Let's see if we can just claw our way up a bit. I don't even think we're gaining right now. Yeah, not a good race. This thing's just weird too. Slippery. Trying all the tricks what we've learned over the last couple of races to try and get us there. But there we go, we've got the sixth place. Um, that's going to bring us down the leaderboard a bit. We might get uh, about fourth, fifth maybe overall in the championship. But that wasn't a good race. Unfortunately. I think I should have went with the Toyota. <laughs> anyway, that's all right. There we go. We got fifth place. Yeah, that's where I thought we were going to come. But uh, that's been fun. It's been fun. Been a good race. Uh, good racing. Um, that last send it lap was. Yeah, it was all right. It wasn't the best lap we've ever done in the world. Um, wasn't the best uh, racing we've ever done. But it was fun overall. But uh, what I'm actually going to do, guys, is uh, I think I'm going to end this one uh, right here. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this one. If you guys have, please hit the like button. If you haven't, there's always a dislike button right next door to that. If you guys haven't hit subscribe already, hit subscribe. It always helps out the channel. Helps the channel grow and all the good stuff. Plus, ring that little bell to be notified when I next upload. Other than that, I'm ending this one right here. Thank you guys again so much for watching. And I'll catch you guys all in the next one. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing?